Hello to everyone at Rentrack.com, this is Jörg Bergmeister. I mean, for me it's a dream come true. I mean, uh, I'm German, uh, grew up in Germany and being involved with uh, the German manufacturer and it being Porsche, I mean, uh, <laughs> there's nothing better than that. Yeah. So, uh, that's definitely the coolest thing that happened to me. Oh, my favorite Porsche race car. Uh, always the latest one that I drove. Probably right now the, the hybrid, the GT3 R hybrid, um, because I was involved in all the development with it. Um, so that's always a part that's a lot of fun to be involved in, in the development and uh, it's probably the favorite car right now. Um, in the US I would say um, Road America is my favorite track uh, because it reminds me of the new Green Notch Life. Uh, so, which is my home track. <laughs> I haven't done too many races there, but uh, it's the, probably the coolest track that is uh, on Earth. <laughs> so it's, it's a great place. If you ever had a chance to go there, you should do that for sure. Um, the favorite race event I would say is Le Mans. Um, not only because of all, all the history that's there, um, but it's just a great venue. I mean, it starts uh, with good engineering on Monday usually, uh, which is already an event by itself and then uh, during the practice days there, was, there are already so many spectators. The driver's parade is just something completely unreal. Uh, I don't know, there's like 50,000 people cheering and uh, it's really cool and the race itself is just great. Um, and go-karts, I mean starting in go-karts is definitely uh, the best thing you could do. Um, I started in the age of three. Um, so you you just pick up all the basics um, for fairly yeah cheap budget that you need, um, but you learn all the basics and you get the feeling. So I think go karts is the way to go. Well, that's a good one. Um, favorite car as a street car, I would probably say the um, the GT2 right now um, is my favorite car because it's just. A cool car with a lot of power. Uh, I enjoy driving that. I had the chance to drive it once. Um, the car that I want to drive, phew, that's a tough one. Um, I drove the Carrera GT, which is a great car as well. Um, so what's, that? what's there? I mean, I'd like to drive the Spider at some point, even though it's not uh, really a, a factory program anymore. But maybe during a test, if there's a chance, I'd def definitely like to try it. On tips, usually, especially with the um, 911 race cars, it's very important to have the diff always locked. So what you want to do is uh, you try to tray brake in the corner as much as possible and then go immediately to maintenance throttle to have the diff locked. Um, and that really helps the stability in the rear and uh, gives you better performance out of the corner then as well. I mean, first off, it was definitely my dad. Uh, he used to be a driver as well, uh, was very successful in the European Touring Car Championship in the 80s. Um, and then I learned a lot from Michael Schumacher. Um, he worked for my dad in his workshop and uh, he taught my brother and myself probably most about go-karting that we know, so that was definitely a big influence. Um, 911 C2S. Uh, good choice. It's fine. <laughs> I mean, always changes the competition is uh, depending on the racetrack. Um, sometimes it's Corvette, sometimes it's Ferrari, BMW. There's so many strong competitors in the series, so um, you can't just say it's it's just one car. I mean, it's uh, the overall competition that is really strong this year um, and has been strong already in the past. So um, you can't just say no it's only one car or only one team it's like probably six or seven cars this year um, that are good for a win and you always have to fight with with all of them i mean right now i'm doing a lot of testing so <laughs> it's reduced a little bit um, doing the hybrid program as well and the bln races i'm, I'm pretty busy uh, porsche keeps me busy in the car which is usually the best training and workout you can do, um, but usually uh, we have a pretty good training schedule um, with the doctors of Porsche. Um, Porsche works together with the University of Potsdam 
um, they give us our training schedules and everything and uh, we try to follow up as good as we can. Uh, what was going through my mind? I mean, um, at the end um, I got a bump in the last corner um, and I talked to Jan about it and he, he's cool about it and I tried to defend the line because I knew I was too late on power because uh, that bump really unsettled the car and I made them one move I'm allowed to do by the rules and uh, the cars touched um, I was leaning on him he tried he was leaning on me and at some point uh, unfortunate enough um, he started spinning and that was my uh, my intention and Jan knows that and that's why I think he's he's cool about it right so you guys are all good yeah definitely awesome Thank you so much, man. Thank you, man. Thank you. It was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. Awesome. Thank you.